Hey guys, this is Omar. In this video, I'm going to show you how you can solve this re-indexing problem in Magento 2. So let's start. I'm a cPanel user. At first, I have to download a software called Putty. You can download it from Google. I mean here. And you can see there is a lot of um, uh, version of Putty. I'm, I'm, since I'm a Windows user, so I'm going to download this one. Okay, and um, since I'm using 64 bit uh, computer, so I'm gonna download this one. Let's download it. Okay, so the download is done. Now install it. I just installed it simply so it's done so now run the putty okay so uh, here here is the software okay so at first now go to cpanel and uh, search ssh okay this one okay so actually in this case you have to uh, get an access using ssh access okay so just click it enable now manage ssh keys now generate a new ssh keys you can write any name here right i'm going to test i write a name here test purpose or test key okay test key and password <coughs> i can generate password from here use this password okay just copy the password okay you will you will need it later okay now uh, keep this same now generate key go back so here is our key in public keys just uh, download it download key so it will be downloaded in your desktop so now you run the put it right in host name collect your host address or IP address from your hosting or cPanel here is mine okay and now go there SSH in AUTH browse download uh, let me find the test Keep up, okay. So uh, you can you can just simply uh, open it. Okay. Now click on open. Okay. Click on yes. No problem. So now uh, you can see uh, you have to log in using your username and password. So this username is your cPanel login username and cPanel login password. Okay, so uh, you can just simply log in here using your cPanel username and cPanel password. So I'm gonna put my cPanel username here. So this is my cPanel username. Now I need to put my cPanel password. Okay, so it's logged in. So you will see uh, this kind of uh, user here. So it's logged in done. Okay. Now um, you have to run uh, some command here. At first, let me check all of the drive. Okay. So this is all of the drive into the C panel. Okay. All of our host uh, files, uh, I mean, Magento 2 resources is into public uh, HTML, this folder, right? So change direction here using the command cd public HTML. I mean, all of our installation file is under public HTML. Magento installation file is under public HTML. That's why I'm changing the direction. 
okay so it's changed now let's clean the cache php bean imagine to cache clean okay so run this command Okay, no problem. Run this command now. HPB Imagine to Flash Run this command. Okay, this one. Now hold on. So the flash is done. Now you can re index using this command. PHP Imagine to indexer index. So you can re index using this command php bean slash imagine to indexer re index. Now hit enter and hold on. It will take few me me minute. Hold on, it will take some time. Okay, so reindexing is done. So now let's check, refresh it. Uh, okay, I will solve this error later, but check all of the reindexing is done. Now it's it's okay. Now there is a cache management. Go to cache management. Mm, okay, there is some error. Just check it. hit refresh and submit it's done so your index re-index is complete so let me check once again from index management okay so our uh, state is ready so re-index is done uh, okay guys don't forget to uh, subscribe the channel and thank you so much for watching the video bye bye